Hey team, Major Foe here, Operation Andromeda. Uh, end of turn 10, KMT USA. KMT has $6, so they're going to buy an infantry and a cavalry. They spend 6, they save 6. Uh, collection, they collect 6. Uh, the only attack they're going to do is into Sink Gang. Uh, this war that never ends against Adel Wolf and the Chinese Civil War. Uh, tried to draw the Japanese in, but they didn't come, so. Here we are, still going. Uh, so for the 106, three cavalry and four infantry will attempt to go in there and slow down the expanse of the uh, CCP. So we're going into a mountain, so we're all negative one in all terms. We are also crossing a river, but uh, only one of the penalties does count. So we have four at one, retreats on ten or up. And three at two, they have two at four, and one at two. Let's see how bad this looks. Uh, one retreat and one hit. And one hit. Okay, I don't hear any sound. Test, test, test. That is working. It's definitely coming over the speakers. Nothing off of here. Hmm. All right, we'll carry on. I don't think we need the game sound, but as long as you can hear me, that's all that matters. Uh, okay, so we both have a hit. So one militia, one infantry, and one infantry retreats. So I lose this dice, they lose this dice from the retreat, and I lose a dice from a hit. So now we have two infantry, three cavalry, versus two infantry. One retreat, one hit, another retreat. And two misses, so back in there. Uh, infantry retreats, cavalry retreats, and an infantry is hit. So we should have one infantry and two cavalry versus one infantry. Looking painful. And wouldn't you know it, the infantry missed, cavalry hit, cavalry retreated. So one cavalry retreats, one infantry, and one cavalry take this territory. There's not a lot to fight with or defend with, uh, considering they have attacked the bomber and uh, some others. So we'll put some cavalry up there. Okay, uh, all in all, not terrible, but not what I was hoping for. Um, okay, so we have that infantry and that cavalry there. Uh, from Shantung, the medium armor is going to move over. Uh, we'll leave the two infantry and three militia there. We'll place another infantry in Shantung and the cavalry up there. Okay, that concludes KMT. KMT Collect 6. We're good to go. On to USA with some research. So I've seen others do this. I'm going to do the same. I'm going to replace these dice because they have been horrid. So Strat Rockets, Large Ship Construction, um, Long Range Aircraft, Then we have jet fighters. We also have heavy strategic rockets. And we have improved construction. 
and improve factories. At this point, I'll take anything as the tech program for the whole game has been terrible. So one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, and not just for USA. Okay, seven dice, see how it rolls out. Okay, four, that's a miss. Seven hits, so improved construction goes to stage two. It's okay. Jet fighters is an eight. That goes to stage two. Long range aircraft is 11. That goes to stage three. Tell me this worked. What? Uh, large ship construction is a 10. That goes to stage two. Every strat bomber is 11. That goes to stage four and completes. America is on the board with a tech. And strat rockets is a 10. They're on the board. Stage one. Holy moly. Okay, on to purchases. So that'll change my buys a bit. Um, I'll take off this destroyer. I'll put on this submarine. And I'll take off the strat bomber and put on a heavy strat bomber. That's still $73. So as I have um, Big Blue Fleet, due to the fact that I have double the uh, capital ships, my ships are a dollar off, but it's not showing on the... The tracker so I put tank destroyers for the two battleships so this battleship finishes I move battleship from stage two to stage uh, stage three to stage two and I start a carrier so that is the artillery and two tank destroyers uh, these are now fives and this is four right fleet carriers five which is now four dollars and battleship is six which is now five dollars so that accounts for this um, and then I'm unleasing a fighter to the UK, an artillery to Iran, a AAA to KMT, and an infantry to Turkey. So that is those land leases. And then three subs and a destroyer. Okay, on to attacks. I put big symbols out here this time, so I won't miss any. Um, the fleet will move one, two, three down to P-47, be joined by the two capital ships uh, at a P-29, and one, two, three, four, this carrier will also join. I'll increase the size of this a bit. Okay. And with that, the tactical will come and land on there. I guess that is a bit of non-combat in there as well. Apologies. Um, just moving the entire fleet to here as these two uh, transports bring one, two, three. They'll bring the light tank, the marine, and two infantry into the Marshall Islands. So... That concludes that fight. So America's up one, Japan is down one. Okay. Over here we have the seaplane moves one, two, goes after these subs. I'm trying to forget that this time. Uh, this fighter and one, two, this destroyer. I don't see any coastal guns along this route, just the fortification. Uh, we'll go after the two subs in H23. It's those dice. And I think that's it I have for combats. So, down here in the med, attacking four submarines, I just have that one seaplane that will submerge them, I believe, till the end of my turn, which means my lend lease can go through into Turkey. Um, but if I'm wrong on that, we'll get uh, Elite to roll the interdiction on this turn. That's a three, I do hit, that's shocking. I will take a coastal sub. This seaplane will go back to Gibraltar. This fight is over. Um, what's been housekeeping, I forgot to mention, but uh, I put it in the group trap, still waiting for a response. Uh, UK has radar, uh, they rolled a two, Elite rolled a six, so two plus two is four, so this I believe should only be two damage, um, not four damage. Uh, so I'll just boost 
UK back up two bucks. If I'm wrong, we have lots of time before the UK turn to uh, to source that out. Uh, okay, that was a successful one. Over here, we have fighter at six, uh, destroyer at four versus two subs at three. Um, because there's two subs in there, I believe they both get to fire back at the destroyer. Um, so here we go. And we have one hit from the destroyer and no hit from the fighter or both uh, submarines. So all in all, not a bad turn. He's here, so non-combat. He's going to move back to England. Uh, this one finishes. And now we're on to non-combat for the rest of it. Okay, so uh, heavy cruiser comes out of port with the transport marine and uh, medium armor. Um, strategic naval move with the transport and two ground units and the um, heavy cruiser is going to move one two three four and then they're going to be in port in Gibraltar so that medium armor lands the marine lands and that and that go into port uh, two militia in New York or in New Orleans are going to rail up to Washington. Two militia in Texas are going to rail all the way to San Francisco. Okay. The two subs here in P29 are going to move to P38. Two battleships are going to move into port in Midway. And I think I think that's it on this side of the board. And then we just had those two subs up here. We're going to move up one into a three. I did forget to, this is a combat movement. So that's going to go on escort here. Apologies, team. And this is going on escort in A18. Now, as I enter, I believe the sub can attack, so. If Elite wants to roll that on his turn, please. Uh, by all means, roll uh, high for you and low for me. would be great. Um, that one's done. So I think we're on to placing units. I don't think I have any other American units on the board. Oh, I do have the medium bomber. Um, and by the look of everything he's got going on here. I think I'm going to move that bomber one, two, three, four into Gibraltar. Um, I'm sure he has enough to uh, make it difficult for the uh, axis on that one. Okay, I think we're good. So we'll go on to place units. So over here, that sub goes into P-22 at this minor factory, correction, at this minor shipyard, um, in the sub base. So I don't think the sub base even matters. Um, these four units are here out of San Francisco. The strap bomber, uh, heavy strap bomber, gets built in London, as we are still double the Russian income. So she'll probably get a card for that territory. Uh, KMT. So if I come out of Texas at this minor uh, oops, factory, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, it is the shortest route and it avoids all of the Japanese ships. If I come this way, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. Hmm. Is it the shortest route? Let me see. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. But I think it's based on the factory you start at. So as I declare Texas as the factory, I think we're golden there. Uh, all the other ships come from this side. Fighter goes into uh, one, two, three, four, five, into southern England. And these two should be able to go through. this side and this side so there's nothing in the way except for these subs um, so if that's the case 
uh, we'll have to roll for both of these. So the artillery going to Iran and the infantry coming into Turkey. Um, I think the other ways are blocked this direction with a fleet here, fleet here, fleet here, um, all these fleets up here. So I think that's the only valid uh, entry point as I've submerged these subs, but I could be wrong, so let me know. Okay, on to America's Collect Income. We're at 62 plus 12 would be 74. I don't think I have any other units to place. And everyone's moves. So 74. I forgot to take my income off. Apologies. All right, team. That will conclude the USA KMT. Thanks for watching. Sorry for the confusion. And on to Elite Golden with Germany.